minutes on the clock right now. T-Bone, you get this first one. Vernon Carey a couple games ago, Miles Bridges last night, two guys that stepped up big for the Hornets. What unexpected role player do you think is next in line to help out tomorrow versus the Knicks? I'm not sure if it's unexpected, but P.J. Washington seemed like a different guy coming back last night from injury. With hunting his shots, they need him tomorrow night to really defend Julius Randle of the Knicks, playing at a high level. P.J. Washington, a key tomorrow night against the Knicks. All right, Brian, the top high school hoops prospect in the country committed to Gonzaga. Does Mark Few finally get a title soon? Well, I tell you what, man, the Zags, they deserve it after last season. What a great season. But one player doesn't make a team, but seven-foot Chet Holmgren at a mini ha ha academy in Minnesota is certainly going to help, especially with a guy who can dunk and block and shoot and also dribble behind the back, too, for a seven-footer. Pretty good start. Yeah, going to be good, fun to watch. Will, thoughts on this Super League being formed by the powerhouse football or soccer clubs in Europe? It's all about money. Those top 12 teams that want to separate. I talk to a lot of soccer people, and they say they don't think this is actually going to happen. They think mm -hmm. that it's going to come back, but it's a play to get more money. They'll likely get more money. But once FIFA says, you know, you're not going to play in the World Cup, players ain't going to do it. Not a surprise. Stan Kroenke behind it all, too, right? Yeah. All right, T-Bone. Several NFL teams have been opting out of OTAs. The Panthers are not one of those teams. So give me your thoughts on them reporting. Not shocking. They're a young football team that needs all the reps they can get. There's not a lot of high price veterans making a lot of money makes sense to me Matt rule young coach young football team they want to get after it for sure sounds good Brian somebody in Australia won 200 grand on a scratch off ticket <laughs> that they forgot they had in their possession it sat empty for two weeks are you a lottery or scratcher guy at all I tell you what I'm a lottery guy my wife is a scratch off and I always buy my wife a lot of scratch off tickets on Thursday night where you can sit in bed and have a little <laughs> wine one time we won about $500 and you take that to the uh, the grocery store to hear him go ding 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 not bad. It's better than a diamond. <laughs> <laughs> well, the Bengals release cleaner new uniforms today. Do you think the Panthers need to change up their jerseys? If you're changing uniforms, you're doing everything wrong on the field. That's all I'll say. <laughs>